Krishna Srikant uh, holding a press conference on the selection of Team India where Sachin Tendulkar has been left out. Let's go to listen. I think, as you know, Sachin has the last couple of years. Uh, Sachin has always last couple of years. Uh, I mean, in the sense that he obviously would like to extend his career, and obviously he's looking at Test cricket in a big way. And I'm sure he must be uh, aiming at the England and the Australian series. Australia also might come, I believe, for the first series. So I think it's going to be a long season ahead. I think Sachin is facing him out very well. I think it's very well appreciated. I, 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 I think, I, frankly speaking, I don't really want to, what he call. I mean, there will be numerous places as why X, why not, why, why not Z. I think it will be very difficult to answer questions. I think we should not be able to, we should look at what has been selected, what is available. I think everybody, is, you should look at the performance of these guys who have been selected. You yourself will understand that the team is an automatic shot. <laughs> See, Virat Kohli, yes, I think Virat Kohli is being appointed the vice captain, right? I think, uh, I think the idea is to have some continuity and also grooming from a futuristic point of view. And let's not forget that Virat, after probably being appointed the vice captain, got those two brilliant hundreds and take him responsibility. And so we have taken everything into everything into account and I think everything is done. And we had, anyway, we had one good thing. One thing, good thing is we had Duncan Fletcher with us as you know, the coach of the Indian cricket team. So we had a lot of discussion about the pros and cons, what happened, what did not happen, what to do, what not to do. So I think it was a very healthy discussion with Duncan Fletcher who represented the team. And so we, were, we have uh, what we call trying to sort out everything and make sure that this season starts out with a bang. It will be announced, uh, we will be selecting data. We have enough time, as you know, we have got a lot of time, like uh, uh, probably till 20th of uh, this month. So I think we just probably had a problem with uh, internally what we, we took, uh, took the opinions of Mr. Duncan Fletcher and everybody, but then it will be announced later after we sit down again. Well, I'm sure, sure, I'm very, very hopeful that I think I believe Yuraj Singh has started his uh, uh, net practice in NCA, which is a very good news for all of us. I think a guy who has won the World Cup for us deserves to come back, and I'm sure he will come back. I think he's got the fighting spirit in him to make a comeback. The very fact that he's fought over this particular day, thing and come out of it and started practicing goes to show the positive approach in that man. And we are all hoping and keeping our fingers crossed. By God's grace, we want we, are, we want Yuvraj back for the T20 World Cup. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.